Lab has everything. Guns, melee, enemies, although derpy enemies nevertheless, and of course more guns. But the one thing that Bone Lab is missing is magic. You heard me. And ever since I used the Force mod, oh boy, does magic really, really work in Bone Lab. Well, as, at least as far as the gameplay feel goes. But on with it. Ladies and gentlemen, it is finally happening. We have magic in Bone Lab, and oh my god, has it been a long time coming, man. We got guns on guns, we got melee weapons on melee weapons, as you can see here. But we finally have magic, kind of, more or less. You'll get what I'm getting at in a minute. Also, it's not called magic, which is why I wanted to bring it to you guys. I was just trying to find mods, and I found this, and I thought, this is magic, but it's under the veil of a cool internet on this series, which I have not watched, even though the mod author was like, hey, you should watch them. I've got so much anime to watch. Why, what are we doing here? I can't, like, we gotta pick one or the other here. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what I'm talking about. That's some pretty fucking magic. Oh my God. Oh, I just, oh, I'm so sorry for it. I grabbed the iPhone. Um, uh, okay. Okay, you know, we're not, we're not, we're not a good wizard. Okay, we're just gonna leave that there. All right, we're not a good wizard yet. We're uh, doing our best. Okay, let's grab one of these so we don't fucking ruin the thing I set up. Give me it. This little guy right here is basically like an amplified version of the Force. Uh, maybe amplify is the wrong word. It, it's a dev manipulator, but with more cool effects, <laughs> essentially. This is called Absolute Sal Salvor. Uh, anyways, when you spawn it, by the way, you'll think you're going insane like the mod's corrupted, but it's there. Uh, it's, you just gotta hit a button, bang, and then it appears like the cool, uh, what's that Marvel movie? Hey, you, you know who I'm talking about. Anyway, so how this thing works is pretty interesting. Um, and I don't know if it works the way it's described, but we'll go we'll go for it. Um, boom, so you activate it by doing this, um, but if you start to aim at something, it'll snap on to whatever it gets. Uh, it can't multi-do that, it's just the one thing that you grab. Then you can switch by hitting the menu button, this little guy, tapping this really quick, that's your alternative hit, it's almost always what activates the weapons. You tap it, and it'll change the color of it. This affects the distance, but I oftentimes feel like it just drops it when, whenever it wants. Um, so we can do this, and it'll go farther away, but then when I hit it again, it, uh, it usually brings it back, which is great, but then if I hit it one more time, it drops it. So I wish it just, it just kept coming back and forth, and you could honestly just do like little stabbies with the knife. Anyways, very cool. You can also just grab it really quick, and grab it like this as well. Basically, the blue is just to activate it. Just to say like, hey, it's no longer invisible. You have a cool rune on your hand. Neat. Anyways, but you can tap it, and then tap it again, just to not lose it. So you have to do like three taps, like bang, bang, bang. <laughs> Yeah, the mod author did, did tell you tell us that it is not exactly good for heavy big things. It, it, it does not do that. <laughs> okay, red mode. Red mode is the most hit or miss thing. Basically, it will throw an object. <laughs> yes. If it's tiny enough, this is almost cer certainly not going to work. Yeah. And if I hit it again, it just it just flew off in a direction. Yeah. Just to this. This one I think works. And then we hold down. And now we're primed. Now we tap it again, and it fires it. You see that? I wish everything worked like that. <laughs> but it's, it's very. I wish. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's 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 great. Let's do something that's definitely tiny, and hopefully, I don't know if it's trajectory. That's the whole weird thing I'm having a stroke about right now. Go to this. All right, let's hit forward in the head. Line, line this up. Bang, and then bang. Okay. Well, yep. I okay. Let <laughs> me do one of these. Is it like here? Where is it? Is this? I did hit him, I think. He's dead. I right, guys, I'll be honest. Let's just pretend red doesn't exist. <laughs> okay? Let's just grab this, and we'll just jostle it forward and back, like that. And we'll just do that. We'll just fully send it in that weird way. I think this also works with this. Also, you can just use your hand. And this is, I think, what it's meant to do, where when you actually move it, it spins stuff, which is what the force doesn't do. The force kind of holds it like the constrictor. This one actually has weird, like, spinning spinning things, which is almost like a blender, which is probably best for, you know, what we're going to be doing, which is killing things. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh god. This is a bad... The Carbard City was not the right place. <laughs> okay, shit. I set up this nice thing. I wanted to try a knife. Okay, well, we have... Okay. <laughs> I should have known that was going to happen. Now, you guys might be coming for me and being like, hey, all right, Grin, I, 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 you're desperate. We get it. Hey, hey. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Give me a sec. You can do stuff like this, which is honestly probably why you're going to get the mod. Uh... Uh, is this, and then you grab this invisible hand thing here. You guys see that little node? You grab it, and then, I'll be honest, hit the trigger until it does something, because it's kind of like, is it happening? No, nope, hit it again. 
There it is. <laughs> Couple hits <laughs> until until it works. And now this son of a bitch is frozen. So now we can climb, and you can do that with damn near everything. Apparently, it does break <laughs> sometimes. This has been the most consistent thing about the mod, though. The the ability to say yeah. And then, heck, and then it just stops. Oh, but you can only have a couple, I guess. Just freeze one thing, so you can't have like a bunch of floating enemies. Oh God. Okay. <laughs> you will, you'll become a monster with this because you just accidentally forget to like unsheathe it and just obliterate someone. Oh, my dear viewers, do you think that's it? There's more, but. We'll get to that later. You can also store this yeah, as a pistol, and it's always going to be there. You guys can kind of see it on my character <laughs> right there. All right, before we get too ahead of ourselves, let's just see what this thing can do. Look at this. There we go. We got forward. And... Uh, oh, I... What happened? I just heard him turn into mist. All right, I got you. I... It, oh, I just smashed his leg against... Oh! <laughs> so fast. <laughs> and extremely violent. God. <laughs> <laughs> see them splat. Yeah, you gotta be really careful with your movements. There we go. Come on, get, come on, gang. All right, here we go. Just a soft, soft block. <laughs> oh, that is, that is a, yeah. Also, I don't think, yeah, if you stay still, it's fine. But if you move it, it turns into like a fucking spinning top, which is just even more brutal. Oh. Oh, if you just go point blank, <laughs> just go. Yeah, just just keep locking. I just tap the trigger. <laughs> just tap the trigger, and you tell me this isn't magic. <laughs> it just pushes them into mist. Go, go. <laughs> also, you do get heated sometimes. You feel so much like the girl from Fear. Remember that goddamn game? There we go. Yeah, so you need to hold so you can like pin people up, but you can't do it by the foot And like you have to have their dominant uh, Body part that means their torso or yeah. chest. All right, so you most likely wouldn't be using. Oh my god. Okay, turn off <laughs> Jesus, you most likely this thing grabs anything. You most likely wouldn't be using this uh, Unless you with it with it you use it with another weapon. Jesus. Okay. Hurry up. Let's get down here Okay All right Oh, man, oh, these ones are, these ones are built quite strong. Oh, what's happening to me? Oh, jeez. There we go, I want teal. Teal seems to be the best. You can just spam it, and it just turns into a, yeah. It just keeps throwing them around. <laughs> Come here, you. Come here. Oh, so far, we haven't needed much of anything else besides this. Eh. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> that works. Yeah. Ah. Jeez. Okay, that works too. And then, ooh, let's get this. And then, does not love picking up heavy weapons, which is uh, heavy material. It's not a terrific fan of it. Yeah, let's uh, let's change it up. Let's use some of this. Teal is our friend. It's the one that I find is the most consistent. Okay, so why is this movable like this? Then I don't know. Ah. Variability, all that. You're a mage. Kind of like telekinesis. Go! Oh my god, it's so fast. Ugh. Just smush. <laughs> smush. There we go. Get this one. Ugh. Got him. <laughs> okay. Ugh. Oh, I finally did. I just grabbed him. And we have a gun, too. Man, this feels stupid. <laughs> Using a gun. When you have the power of, uh... Well, yeah. Also, can I do it with this? I did! Ha ha ha! Guess what? I trapped your gun arm. And now you're just sitting there. Now I feel. Oh no, we gotta be careful. <laughs> Don't point it down. You might grab yourself in the telekinetic pole. Alright, I'll just. This just feels bad now. Alright, well now I just feel bad because of another reason. Alright. I mean, I don't really think we need to prove more. <laughs> this thing is, uh. It, it's, it's a little finicky, which is similar to the forest mod. But hey, that's, you know, that's magic. We're a beginner mage, buddy. We're like figuring it out. <laughs> All right, one last thing to test with these, which I forgot to do. Let's stick it on teal, because teal works the best, at least to me. And go. Ugh. Doom zombies, zero. What if we grab something? Ugh. There we go. Yeah, it's better just to, just to disco rave with these. And things die. Keep those arms moving. Everything becomes a cyclone. <laughs> this, oh my god. 
that's so sick. Oh, literally, like we're a sick human being. Oh my goodness. We're just cleaning up the trash. By God. Ladies and gentlemen. Uh, yes, at this point, nothing really. Even if they get up, it's kind of like, yes, maybe they could hurt us. There it is. And yeah, just... Let's just... Just kind of like, yeah. We're just gonna... We're just gonna... Alright. <laughs> Ugh. Hey, did I ever tell you how much I love our members? Thank you so much for supporting me. Appreciate you. The whole reason why we're doing this and we're doing it as hard as we can and all these things. I love you to bits. Hope I can see you next month as well. Mwah! Ladies and gentlemen, your eyes do not deceive you. We have magical staff. And it, it, it works, okay? Yes, it might be a Call of Duty mod. Shut up. It's, it's the closest thing we hear yet. <laughs> okay. Also, I mean, frankly, they're like high-res textures. They actually have cool functionality to them in terms of being unique and how you reload them and all these things. It works. Stop. <laughs> okay. Also, the effects on these are like genuinely just shockingly impressive. Look at this. Isn't that just beautiful? I should get closer. Look at that. Oh, too close at this point, but yes, look at that. Look at caca, eagle, all that. Okay, so a quick demonstration of how you actually reload these, which is a little weird. Um, essentially, you guys can see that we have this little lever right here. You guys see this like little ledge? Well, if you grab this and you pull down, it acts as like a shotgun, and it will pull this mechanism down. So I grab it, pull down. Am I in the right place? Yeah, so that loaded it. Now, the, the, the reloading of the crystals is kind of the thing where you just kind of, you just kind of get it to accept it. Eventually, it will... There we go. Yeah, so you just kind of keep pushing it. I, I, You can sometimes hit the trigger, which is the fire button, and then you can get it in there. But now that it's in there, you have to reload it. Like that. And now it's primed. Did you guys see the, the mechanism fire? Anyways, let's uh, let's just say hi to Deadpool. Uh, yeah, this one I think is what I think it is. Yeah. <laughs> Did you see that? Delete it. Okay, never mind. He's fighting me a little bit. All right. Now that's about as many crystals as we got. So in order to reload it again, we grab this. And it will just accept. And then we load the shotgun. We have to make sure you grab this bit. This goddamn... There we go. Oh, okay. So, basically, when you've emptied it, the reload kind of changes. You have to basically push the crystal in, which you do by firing the gun. You know how when you have a, an empty mag in your pistol? You can tap the trigger to push the rack forward, I guess. Similar thing to that, and then we just grab it. We grab it, and then we pull it down, and now it is reloaded. And now we're good to go again. I get rid of him. Ah! Oh, I guess we don't need it at that point. Well, it does send things. Oh, I, my, my nightmare happened. Okay, well, well let me get, come cut back to us in the real real world. <laughs> okay. All right, let's go ahead and showcase the rest of these. This is also probably will help for people who are having confusion about how these things work. Also, look how beautiful they look. Look at that. Tell me that's not magic AF. I mean, yes, it's steampunk, but you know, what can you get in 2022? You grab the crystals and you smack it in there. Good. There it is. See? Easy. First attempt. First attempt. And then we grab this little guy. And then we reposition our hand. And we just... Pull. There we go. You can see it move a, a, smile, a small amount, and then it rotates forward. God, words are hard. And then we just fucking do that. Isn't that awesome? That's three. Tell me that's a magic AF. <laughs> okay. Okay, I think you get the point. Let's save these last two for actual combat engagements, but they the same thing with a bunch of amazing things. Also, look how beautiful all this looks. My texture in my hand, not the best, but... Let's cut to some gameplay. <laughs> yeah. All right, what a better place to use a lightning, yes, this is lightning, <laughs> um, staff, than the neon rave. There we go, and then we just, there we go, we wasted a shot, <laughs> damn it. Hey, hey bud, how is this as a melee weapon, by the way? Ugh. This is not very good. <laughs> it looks very heavy, it is just kind of fine. Man, oh no. I killed myself the minute. Oh god! Alright, let's be more careful. Hey, King. Oh, I think it's a black hole gun. I'm not sure if it's it says lightning gun. I'm not sure that's that's right. Let's just run ahead. See me, see me. Ah. Okay, okay. And we're gonna ah. I feel like we're it's like we're sucking the soul out of people. <laughs> you know? And yet they're still kind of alive. It's an easy to aim, which is dope. Hey, yeah, okay, so it does travel through everything. So maybe that's it. It's like a, it's like a pierce weapon. Also, it does kill. Okay, yeah, you can hit with it. It does work. We <laughs> want to use it as a, a fucking makeshift blunt weapon. There we go. Hey, sir. Yeah, I'm about to say. 
his, his body had to catch up and realize, oh, I'm dead. I'm so unbelievably... Ah, fuck, there we go. Also, it is cool that you just can pivot the thing, <laughs> how easy that is. Like, this staff works actually much better than a lot of other staffs we've used in other VR games. Yeah. Ah. All right. Oh, it's stuck. Okay. Jesus. All right. Oh, you are so silent. You're probably not. It's so big. It's in the way. Also, if you did get, like, you know, if Bone Lab ever got a shit together and you have fought hard enemies, you could basically uh, sh shoot a f uh, three spread in their chest. Damn it. I'm explaining something. God damn you. Okay, maybe we should also try being a little bit more of a beefier boy. I got the avatar just for that, by the way. Come on, hit me with it. The f most freakishly o overpowered uh, skin I've ever seen. It's literally fucking 8K. <laughs> okay. I think our boy has yeah, pretty good strength. <laughs> Much better. <laughs> Much better. Right, here we go. And... Okay, it's more like it affects them more than others. Okay. <laughs> Why did that come back at me? You guys, you want to see him crazy also? Look at this. Isn't, that, isn't this fucking crazy? <laughs> this dude, person I found who makes these goddamn things is insane. Hey. Oh, I, it's, I'm sure I'm not reloaded yet. Speed reload. Speed. 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 Get the fucking knife, son of a bitch. Goddamn you. There it is. <laughs> you know what I think of when I think of cryo? I think of zombie slang. All right, and... Oh. Hey, this one, uh... <laughs> <laughs> this one's coming in a little hot, I'll be honest. It's just like a massive, like, <laughs> cocaine. <laughs> basically, and you're coked out of your mind. And you're coked out of your mind. How does this look when you jibble at someone? Let's. All right, so these are the purple ones, which are pretty uh, dense. So let's see how bad, uh, how much damage it does. <laughs> so sick. Does it actually have wind? No, it doesn't have any force. That's saved for wind. This is just a delete button. Clean up the trash. Sweeping. Well, I feel like a wizard's apprentice. <laughs> Whereas your master's like, clean up all the dead bodies. We're a bad person <laughs> in this story. All right. Let's end this. Wait. Okay. <laughs> Let's end this. Oh, I know. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know my power yet. <laughs> okay. Whenever there's something wrong happening, it's because you're holding this thing. The world's like, it's touching me. <laughs> it's affecting me. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is what I was... Yeah, this thing might just take the... Uh, <laughs> didn't even hurt. Just delete it immediately. Hey. Hey, guys. I'm gonna get the left half. Wow, that's got some range. No, not you. Hello, sir. Uh, yeah, and now we just got his body. Just chilling. There we go. Now we can do teal, and we got gotcha. you. We got gotcha. you. Hey, look at you. Go. I think we just tap it a lot. No way. <laughs> I can use this. <laughs> oh, that's sick. <laughs> Holy fuck. How, how oh, yeah, it goes all the way forward. All right, let me try to get up here. Can we actually gamify this? Oh, we can't. <laughs> we got sent. We got sent so hard. <laughs> Come here, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I yanked him right off the edge. <laughs> right, what happened here? Oh, no. Come on. Well, okay, just come on. There we go. A little bit lower. Okay, good. That's fine. We can we can work with that. Let's go turn this thing off. Okay. Whew. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Yikes. Go and there we go. Just chill right there, your friend. I mean, honestly, this is some shit. Hey, hey, you're right. The fuck you are. Look at that. Look at that. Now I accidentally have you, and it's just yeah. Wow. Just anything. <laughs> Just kind of, yeah. Everything becomes chaos <laughs> and a mess. Can we hit this, you think? Yes. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, that was a ton of fun. I regret nothing, but man, did, this is magic is meant for the sick and the twisted. Because <laughs> a bullet just gone, just straight to the head, a minimal mess, which I thought was a joke. But no, uh, my god, magic is meant for just visceral violence blood man just be just the cleanup on being a gosh darn anyways it i okay ladies and gentlemen um thank you so much for your time hope i can see you once again uh we again we're doing daily uploads forgive me if i miss a day i'm it's sunday and i'm filming this i'm like oh my god kill me 
Um, I can edit this, upload it, yeah. Um, but regardless, ladies and gentlemen, go support the mod authors. They're brilliant. The fact that all of these mods worked as well as they did in a kind of a broken-esque modding kind of uh, situation. Finish Bone Lab, uh, brilliant. Menefique, very good. Especially the, the the staffs work like absurdly well. Like again, I I hope dearly one day we can actually get like maybe it's an avatar or maybe it's something like that. But uh, similar to how Adam Smasher works, uh, I don't know if it's even possible. So I might be just talking my ass here, but it'd be amazing. Give it a minute. There we go. <laughs> oh, this was not a great idea. Similar to how Adam Smasher works, where you grab this little node, you tap it, and then it basically triggers this change in your hand. You grab this node, and now you have a gun. It would be awesome to see that, but instead of a bullet, it's one of these magic effects that come from the staff. That'd be so ungodly sick, although I'm sure wildly hard. Uh, the other thing that I, I want, and I think if I ever did commission a mod, which I broke ass right now, that's why the videos look so good, is because I bought a gaming PC, um, and I'm using my old one to capture everything, so I just got full send, beautiful gameplay. Anyways, the one mod I would love to see is, uh, is basically the same thing, an avatar, except when you go to activate the wrist mount, uh, it would activate the dev manipulator, which is basically the force. It's the telekinesis gun. Can I get this? I can. I can show it to you guys. It's this mod right here. This is basically what all of these, I think, are kind of built off of, but I'm kind of, again, talking out my ass here. This guy right here. This, it, first of all, it looks so sick. Um, but this. This same premise, you can pick up weapons like that and then throw them. <laughs> In fact, it looks, it works really well. But also you can grab this little ball here and like slingshot things and fire them off. So imagine if you had that same thing, you activate this wrist mount, you have this little tiny little orb behind your hand, you grab that orb, you can then throw things or just telekinetic grab shit and throw it. Kind of like what we were doing with the, with the one thing. That'd be my ideal avatar. Also, if you had actual skin texture, cause uh, thumbnails, people want to see an actual human body and not, you know, weird cyber hands <laughs> but anyways ladies and gentlemen i'm sure i'm glitching like crazy i'm kind of bopping <laughs> but hopefully i can see you once again uh and thank you kindly for your time